All right, let's try this again. What is going on, guys? Devinator here, and I know I'm in the middle of a battle, but I started recording, and I looked up in the top corner of my Elgato software, and it said that it had no signal, but I was still able to play the game. I can see it on the screen, and I have it because I play on a monitor. <coughs> if you know, you know. But um, <laughs> it uh, said that I had no signal, so I wanted to check and make sure that we still... Uh, I <laughs> was not wasting my time and capturing all this footage and having to go back and redo it and essentially missing out on all this. So I gladly I caught it. I was only like four minutes into the video. But anyway, guys, how was y'all's weekend? Mine was pretty good. Had Sunday off, got quite a bit of stuff done. We... Uh, Got our family room cleaned out of some of my grandpa's stuff that he had here. As you know, that I moved into uh, his um, old house. We got a shiny uh, battle CD. Um, okay. Uh, Glagar fainted. Oh well. Um, is this one? Yes. This is one. Um, but we got that cleared out for the most part. So. Our pool table is getting ready to go down there. I did see a million pieces right now, so I gotta remember how I put this thing, took it apart, and put it back together soon. <laughs> um, and then I done some work downstairs in the gaming room, the new studio, our game collection room, where all the magic's gonna happen for these videos and gameplays and collecting. If you guys follow my game collection, um, which you guys definitely should. Um, I post most of that in my Twitter and uh, my Facebook, my Devinator Gaming Facebook page. Those links will be in the description. We'll talk more about that later in the video. But uh, that's where all the magic's going to happen. That's where all the good stuff's going to happen. So I can't wait to get down there. This uh, room that I'm recording in now will be my fiance's photography studio. And that'll be this will be like her little room. She's got a backdrop all set up for her stuff. I got her a camera for her birthday, so that'll be all set up and ready for her to use. And we will be downstairs in like a basement, uh, recording our stuff down there. But it still should be great. I'm excited for our own, my own area. She's excited for her own area. It's a win-win all around. Make everybody happy. Um, but didn't do a whole lot this weekend. Just got some stuff moved out that needed to be moved out. And these guys are not playing around. I really need Espeon to stay alive. <laughs> because we've got to battle like four more of these people, I think. <laughs> so I need Espeon to stay alive. Because the Pokemon Center is like all wrapped up right now. And that's not good. So I'm just going to keep attacking the one with the highest health with Espeon. Because it should one hit KO all of those. It should hit. It should knock them all out in one hit. And I'm just going to keep trying to keep them at bay with Teddy Ursa. Hopefully they attack Teddy Ursa more than Espeon. Or whoever my second one is. But I did go through and heal up all my Pokemon in the previous little snippet that I recorded on accident. It wasn't on accident. I think it was fine. It probably was fine. But uh, I just wanted to make sure it was fine. <laughs> because I don't want to get through. I've done this before on my Need for Speed series. And it would go through and I recorded a whole episode and like halfway through. We lost like everything. You could only hear me talking in just the screen of everything. So I don't want to go through that again. I don't want that to happen. So you missed out on like the first five, four or five minutes, but it wasn't nothing exciting. We beat the other purple guy and healed up some of our Pokemon. Which is a good thing that I have some more of these encounters because I think we would be in trouble if I didn't. Oh yeah, that finally killed it. Hell yeah. Go Teddy Ursa. Even though you're no, like nine levels above these guys. <laughs> Even though you're like really high level. Espeon's a star. Espeon is definitely the star in this series. Uh, but, um, yeah, this is pretty much what's going on. Uh, wrapping up and catching up my life. <laughs> uh, next week, we should have some family coming back up from Tennessee. They'll be staying with us for the weekend. 
and we sh I should have all weekend off. That'll be nice. We'll get some stuff done around here, and maybe we'll be moved into the new game room. Um, very possible. Oh, yeah, yeah. I just wanted to make sure that there was no fuckers up here. We should be moved into the new game room by then. That'll be awesome. Super excited for that. I'm going to attack this guy. Come on. Come on, come on. So we've seen red, green, and purple so far. This will be the third one. And they're, these are tough. Not necessarily tough, but they just have a full team. And that sucks. <laughs> that sucks. It really does. Uh, but as long as Espeon's alive, I'm pretty confident in our ability to win. I really am. A Metal Claw Numel. I hope I didn't attack Numel. If I do, it should one hit KO. And hopefully this I didn't. I attack Slugma. Hopefully Espeon keeps one hit KOing him. There he's 11, 11, 12 levels higher than the highest level that I've seen so far. So he should keep one hit KO and, and Teddy Ursa just gained a level. That's also good. I should probably switch out, but I don't want to mess around and lose. Ooh, Houndor, that's not good. And that's a shadow Pokemon. Hopefully this guy only has three. This will be nice. Just go ahead and knock these all out. Because I'd like to get all these done and into that lab to deliver the message. By the end of this episode, I'm going to try and do Metal Claw on Houndor and hopefully knock out. Um, hopefully that doesn't burn Teddy Ursa. Please don't burn. Okay, it did not burn. And then, oh, but can you, he's a shadow type, so I can use that. Oh. Uh, yeah. Oh, it still doesn't affect him. Fuck. <laughs> no. Damn it. Oh, well. That's all right. I'm going to try Shadow Blitz as a beast move. Oh, no, no, no. Teddy Ursa's dead. Teddy. Oh, he lived on two. He lived on two. Um attack and, uh, metal claw I, I want to get rid of this hound door that shadow blitz will really mess up Espeon also and I knew that wasn't gonna kill hopefully yes oh thank god thank god Teddy Ursa attack hopefully it oh no it lived it lived no this is a, this is a terrible move this is a horrible move please just attack Teddy Ursa please thank god all right we lost Teddy Ursa there. See ya. But we do have the revive. And I want to save that. So we'll bring out Snorunt. And hopefully he can do something. <laughs> hopefully he can do something. Please don't die. He's a shadow Pokemon. But that means like everything's pretty much super effective against him, I think. Oh well. Um, quick attack on Houndor. That'll get rid of that. Uh, sh 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 I don't know. I don't know what that does. <laughs> it's gonna do something though. Houndor's gone. And I'm getting ready to do this shadow wave. I don't remember what that does. Shed seed, but it failed, okay. Um Ember. Espeon. Eesh, not too bad. I need Espeon to stay as full health as I can. Infusion on Numo. I, I don't know. I don't know these moves. And then I'll have to go back to the place and purify this guy. I don't remember where that's at. It's, uh, it's in one of the cities. I, I I will be able to remember to go back and watch a video or something. But I'll be able to find it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fall over and, and, and cry. And I, I take your monies. Uh, okay, blah, blah, blah. Leave. Alright, so I've defeated three of them. There should be three more, I think go down here there's not there is there one over here no maybe they're in the gym I didn't think they were in the gym though is there one over here I'm not seeing one over here there's one here yeah blah 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 I know you're not so there's blue I think there's two more I'm pretty sure there's two more and it's not just because they have the number, the the spelling word of six in their name. I honestly think that there's two more. 
So I think they're definitely going by uh, typings here. So skip one is grass, I think. Uh, maybe? Um, but I'm going to go for horsey and sleep powder on Goldeen. Just put it to sleep and let Espeon do the work. Sounds like a plan to me. Horsey's fainted. Skip Loom will level up, so that's cool. Hopefully it learns something good. Beldum. Okay, it doesn't go by typing necessarily. Uh, go to sleep. And then I could attack Goldeen. Get rid of Goldeen and put Sleep Powder on Beldum. I think that's what I'll do. So I'm just going to keep doing that. Oppositing. And... Just to keep them, just to, you know, mix it up a little. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh. Goodbye, Goldine. See how I went belly up? It's funny. Just feel, maybe it is, and maybe like they just have one that's random. This is a shadow Pokemon. I don't think I have any balls. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> that's not good. <clears throat> so much for that. Skip Loom, don't die. Oh. Um, confusion on... I really need to get rid of that spiel. Um, hopefully, that's, hopefully it goes to sleep. Hopefully that attack doesn't miss again. But I really need to get rid of this. Because it's got those shadow moves. And those shadow moves are... <sighs> that's all I have to say. They will mess you up. Here we go. Sleep powder. This attack did not miss. Go to sleep, Beldum. So this will pretty much guarantee... He doesn't have any more Pokemon either. That's good. Usually when they send out their Shadow one, it's the last one that they have, so... Hopefully that uh, this is the case. <laughs> Who am I kidding? He has no more. He would have already thrown it out. Um, well, I'm glad I attacked with Skip Loom then because that didn't kill it. This is not very effective. And oh my god, it didn't kill it either. Just be asleep. Just don't wake up. Just be asleep. Good. So, quick attack and tackle. That's not very effective either. Wow. But I still beat him. Give me that XP. I actually might switch Skip Loom. I'm actually probably not. I'm just going to keep running through this. Espeon is the team. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, is there any up here? There's a shiny. There's a battle CD. Whatever. Is there anything up here? So there's that one up here. Is the PC still closed? Yeah, it really is. Damn it. What's down here? I don't know. Um, whatever. Going back up here. PC still closed. That's not good. There can't be too many more. Is the shop still closed? You've been closed forever. Oh. Wow, I didn't see that coming. So maybe there's someone in front of the Pokemon Center that I had to beat. I did not see that coming at all. I did not foresee that battle coming. Maybe the Pokemon, uh, Pokemon Shop will open up now. Um, go ahead and do that. And um, Sleep Powder Spoink because it's, it's Psychic Type 2. So I don't think this Psychic move will be very effective against it. I can go ahead and get rid of the Volbeat though. Yay. Oh, how clever. I just figured that he would have both of them out there. Illumise and Volbeat. Those Pokemon are like really useless. You know, the, the only reason why they're of, of any importance is to get to complete Pokedex and Ruby and Sapphire. They are not very good. I've never really used them. They are not good. Um, 
I'll just tackle Spoink, try and get some of that down. Oh, don't do that. Don't do that, boy. That one's dead. Oh, it didn't. It lived. It lived on like one. No, I should have tackled. Damn. Well, I know what I'll do next. Um, how can it bounce when it's asleep? Well, I know what I'll do next. I will bite with that. I could do swift. I could do swift. I can do that. And then I'll... I forgot I had swift. And then I'll take that out. And then I'll also be able to attack Spoink a little. And that's okay. Oh, it's a viper. Is it just straight poison? I think it may be. I think it may be just straight poison. So I'm gonna confuse the viper. I hope it's just straight poison. Okay, it's not dark. That's all that matters. I can't remember. Sweet. So viper's gone. So now nothing's gonna get poisoned. Nice try. Nice try. I wish the Viper would get an evolution. Maybe in shield and... Jesus, a full team. Fuck. Maybe in shield. Probably not, but we can speculate a little, I suppose. Spoink woke up and side wave. Probably... I don't know what this does. Um, Skiplin's dead. <laughs> That's what that does. So I think I got one, I got two left. Um, we'll just throw out Snora. Good, yay. Confusion on Whalmer and Shadow Wave. Maybe this will do something. I don't remember what these Shadow moves do. They all do different things. Whalmer is a tank. I'm surprised it took him out. Whalmer is a tank. Reflect, um, raise defense, but you're pretty much done for anyways. What's this do? Does it attack? I hope it attacks. It does. Alright, yay, it's died. Alright. So there's that. You're defeated, boy. Girl, whatever you are. Give me the monies. Maybe the shop's open now. Uh, I don't have time for that shit. Yes, the shop's open. All right, what's up here? I thought I saw a shiny. Can, can I even do anything up here? What's up here? What do you got? Bye. Um, nothing, thank you. Um, nothing up there that's really important to me. What do you got over here, boy? Bye. Hell yeah, here come some balls. But I need um, some super potions. Go ahead and give me like 10 of those. Um, give me a few of these. Give me like five of these, please. And give me... We don't have any regular potions. Give me two more of those. Give me, give me a few of these, ten of them, and give me five of these, give me ten of these, and give me like twenty of these. All right. So we've got balls, and we got we got balls, we got healing items, we got everything we need. So first things first, I'm going to go in here and use a super potion on Espeon. I wonder if there's a guy out here. Is there, are you a real? Nope, you are not a real person. 
I figured this was the case. After I battled the person in the Poke Shop. So I'm gonna hit Carvana with. Ah, oh, Psychic like doesn't affect him. I'm gonna hit him with something else. I'm gonna hit him with a Swift and Shadow Wave. <clears throat> Oh, that's a crit. Yes. That's nice. I'm not even mad, bro. You're going to send out your coughing, and it's going to get hit by the shadow wave? Okay. Kill it. It didn't kill it. Kill it. It didn't kill it. So we'll do Swift again and Shadow Wave again. Swift should kill the Goldeen. And I don't know what it'll do to the coughing. It probably won't kill it. it done an okay amount of damage. Mighty Anna's coming out. Damn it. Sucks because I can't use... I can't use Psych against him either. I'll just keep using Swift because I can't use. I don't want to waste my psychic attack against coughing. Swift again and Shadow Wave again. This should kill coughing. Espeon will level up. Yeah, that killed coughing. Sweet. Okay, do you have any mores? Espeon leveled up. Nope, no more. So this is the last one. Ooh, damn, Stormrun's about to die. Pretty much, we're going to have Espeon by the end of this. Alright. I'm just going to do Quick Attack. Shadow Wave. I figured that much. Hopefully he attacks Odor Sleuth. What does this do? Identified Snore Runt, whatever that means. I just hope this attack hits. It will. It'll kill. So there's that. Yay! So I defeated him. I wonder if the whole town's like full of these people. I wonder if the PC's back up. Nope. So there was, that was a thought. It was a thought. Um, I wonder if this lady is a cipher. Are you a cipher? Yeah, this whole city is cipher. Holy shit. I've been bamboozled. Pseudo Wudo. Wow. I haven't seen one of those. And Clamperol. I think that's Gen 3 too. Wow. I haven't seen one of those in forever. Good thing is, Snorrun's gotten okay, Bite, Confusion, uh, Clan Pearl, Bite on Pseudo Wudo. Yay, Clan Pearl fainted. Hopefully, it has a really cool shadow Pokemon. I'll catch it now that I have balls. Pokeballs, Ultra Great and Regular, Flail. Damn, Snorlax fainted. Um, Pineco. All right. Um, confusion to Pseudo Widow, and that's it. He doesn't have anything else. So that's all right. This will be an easy one. You died. The end. The end of you. So this whole town is full of them. Wow, I can't believe that. Everybody in this town is probably a, um, maybe not the old men. Let's go see if the old men are. Are you a cipher? Nope, he's real. Is this guy real? Nope, 
Nope. That guy is not real. I can't believe this. This is like a major turn of events here. The Cyphers have taken over this whole town. Well, I knew he was going to have a dust cold, duh. But I'm going to use, um... Maybe that dust is a shadow type. If it, if it is, I'm going to catch it. It's not. So I'll just... Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> no. What the fuck? Uh... Uh, okay, well, I'm out of... It doesn't affect Duskull, that sucks. Damn, I'm out of PP. I wonder if I have a, a PP up thing. Torment, what does this do? Was subjected to torment. I don't know what that means. Kill it. Kill it, Panko. Super effective, but it didn't really do much. Um, item. HP, um, HP, HP. There, I need to use this. On Espeon and Confusion. And Shadow Blitz. Duskull again. That sucks. I wish I would have paid more attention. Because I would have given it an ether before. An ether, ether, whatever. Before this. Oh no. Please don't die, Espeon. Granted, I do have revives and stuff. I'll just Shadow Blitz it again and it'll die out. Confuse Corefish. And Shadow Blitz. I really need that Duskull to die. Now, that's a crit. Corefish is Gondis. Bye. <clears throat> Quillfish. Nightshade. Damn. Damn. He's really tearing Espeon. A new one. Hopefully this. This should maybe, maybe kill? It did. Good. That Duskull is a pain in my ass. Alright, so there's no more. Son of a bitch. That sucks. So that's what Torment does. Still kill it, though. Alright. I'll probably go ahead and try and fight one more. Clear this town up a little bit more. And then hopefully be close to probably be ending this episode here shortly. This this lady's probably one. <laughs> Damn. I can't believe that. That's crazy. Hey, everyone. Except for that old man. Alright. Shep it. You're going to die. And that's that. I'm going to kill Shep it first. Goodbye, shove it. And Teddy Ursa, you will die also. Just not yet. The shove it is dead. Good, I don't want it to do no stupid fucking ghost type moves on me. Corsola. Maybe that'll get an evolution. Oh, it did get an evolution, I think. Yeah, it did. I'm not up to date on all the new Pokemon stuff. Uh, but, um, your time to die, Corsola, and... Oh, no! No! Damn it. I fucked up. Maybe it'll automatically... I feel like I've done this before. Did it automatically go to Teddy Ursa? Maybe she'll throw out another one. If it does, then that's cool, too. Oh, no, it dug a hole. Great. Oh, son of a bitch. I'm not wasting a PP on it. Let's press bite and shadow blitz. It'll miss. <sighs> Alright, that's good. Good. I'm glad it attacked Pinko. It done nothing. Here comes the shadow blitz, boy. 
And then I'll just do a quick attack. And this don't matter. All right. So I think this one's going to wrap it up. We're already at 30 minutes. I'll wrap it up here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you did enjoy. And if you did, be sure to hit that like button. Also, subscribe to the channel if you are new. And be sure to check out the description, as I was mentioning earlier. And follow me on Twitter, at Devinator17. And follow my Facebook page, Devinator Gaming. Both links will be in the description below. And I hope you do follow those and show support to those as well. Uh, thank you guys so much again for watching. If you did enjoy, please be sure to hit the like button. It really does mean a lot. It helps me out tremendously. And I will see you all in the next video.